Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome back. We're going to take a look now at the challenges on offer and see how well uh, we get on. We've sort of done the basics and we've definitely improved, I'd say. Um, Coaching Academy, let's go there. Let's have a look at Trackman. There's only nine of these. Trackman Performance Putting Evaluator. Performance by setting up tapping. Get your ball close to the hole from various spots. Okay. Hit three putts to within one foot. Hit four putts to within one foot. Okay. So we should be better at this. Um, it just depends on how much break there is in the ground. Um, I'm just wondering if the wind indicator indicates which way the ground is going to break, perhaps. find out right so take a step back it's downhill by 0 0.8 and the hole is currently 10 foot away so i'm gonna say put this to like two foot which seems crazy see how we get on three foot was the way then obviously that the more it goes the less you need to do it 1.4 so let's say half a degree above it's downhill again it's 10 foot i'm going to say about six foot i'm going to say three let's try that see how well it's really broken to the left All right, 1.1, so doesn't even tell me how far it is. That's annoying. It's uphill, 10 foot away. So I'm thinking at least, say, 18 feet. Seems a lot. Oh, it was. 15 was about right. Downhill, very slightly, 0 0.8 below, so for every two, let's say one degree, so it's it's 10 foot, so I'm going to say six, I'm a bit to the left, see how we get on. Hmm, there doesn't seem to be any consistency yet. The hole is 10 foot, it's uphill. And then downhill. We need to give it a little bit extra to get it over the hill first, but not too much that it's going to run on past the other side. So, I'm going to say, give it an extra five. That's way too much. Oh no, it went in. It's definitely travelling though. Let's go again till we learn. So let's say it's about half whatever the percentage is or the angular difference is. So that's 0 0.7. So it's at 10 foot, 0 0.7, uh, three and a half foot. So we'll take it down to seven foot. And I think that'll be it. Overhit it slightly. Oh, not too bad. If it was on target, I think it would have gone in. Uh, so it says this is downhill. 1.4. So we'll bring it back. Four feet. Let's try that. That was damn near straight, but it went off to the left. one below and it's 10 feet so I'm going to say five was it was it uphill and I didn't pay attention 
That's definitely below. Uphill and then downhill. So basically, where we are. This is definitely tricky. I'm not, I'm not feeling like there's any consistency at the moment, so I can't work out how much power to put on it or not, or whatever. So this is 0 0.7 below. So it's a downhill putt. So it's 10 foot. So half of 7. Let's go 7 foot. I under hit it slightly. That's not too bad. That's within a foot. Ten foot again. It's one point four. Let's bring it down to seven foot. Kind of going on instinct rather than calculation. That's just over a foot, damn it. Right, uphill this time, 1.1, so I'm going to say 12 foot. Oh, if I hadn't moved to the right, it would have gone in. Uh, pretty much flat, a little bit of downhill, a little bit of uphill. I'm going to take two foot off that. That's within a foot. Uphill and then downhill. We got three. Definitely putting is our worst thing. All right, 20 foot now. Let's see how this hands out. Huh? I guess it depends on on the green. You've got fast greens, slow greens, medium greens, so on and so forth. There's no information. No information about the shot. So this is 1.7 foot above. It's 20 foot there. So I'm going to say about half that distance. We'll see what happens. One point nine foot. Sixteen feet. Wow, why is it going all the way over there? And that one has just gone miles past. Even though they're all very much the same. This one's 2.4 below. 
So we're going to take five off it, so we're down to 15 feet. Okay, 14 feet, just to be sure. Why is it breaking so far to the right? This is what I don't understand. There's one below. See, to me, that just looks like a straight shot. And it kind of is. I hardly took anything off that. And it didn't go miles past. So we've got to get within two feet. This is very strange. How is it being calculated? So, key locations, black, hole location is Monday, course conditions, average, second cut length is medium. Other than that, there's no information there about this green. So let's say we take one, f one foot off for every one degree. So that would be, let's say, 18 feet. Just outside of 17 feet, right? Bit to the left. Just roll past that two foot. Actually, it went way past two foot. So that wasn't enough. So let's double it up. So 1.9 is, say, 2 feet. So we'll come down to 16 feet. And we'll go again. Why did it break so far to the right? Again, 16 feet. It's going miles past. Right, this is 2.4 below. So it's downhill and then a bit of uphill. Okay, 2.4. So let's double that to 5, which is 15. And then we'll add the same again. The 12 foot. Let's see what happens. I am not I am not reading it, I'm not getting it. One below. I've got to keep doing it until I until I get some sort of understanding. I've always been a firm believer of never go past the hole. If you're always hitting towards it and you're getting closer and closer and closer, that's far less demoralising than hitting it and going straight past, which absolutely destroys my morale, I have to say. So let's go 15 feet. Not a bad shot. So that's within two feet, but it did go past. This is 1.9, so I'm going to go 10 feet. Why does it break so far to the left? Same again, 1.9. So. 15 feet was too much. It's 16 feet. Look at that, it just goes on and on and on. What? Oh. 
Right, this one will be 16. So the weight was good. So this one I think would be about 15. Quite getting it, are we? We're not breaking the back of this yet. One point seven above, so it's going downhill all the way, non stop. We we'll go fifteen. about the right weight. So this is 1.9 below. So this is even more below, all downhill. So let's cut it down to 12. But almost half the distance. Why does it break right like that? Where is the indication that it's going to do that? Exactly the same. Both feet. It's a little bit too far past. I'm seeing absolutely no consistency at all. And why is this one flicking between 0 0.9 and 1 degree below? That's got to be a bug, right? So we're looking at just over five foot for every one degree. We try that. One foot for every... Even that doesn't make sense. Right, so it's all down here, 1.7. So that's near, nearly... 10 degrees off, right? So we'll say we'll say 12 for that. Slightly over here. <clears throat> Two foot tall, we'll take. So that's nearly again all downhill, nearly very nearly. Uh, so we we'll go 10 degrees this time. Oh, that is massively over here. Why does it keep breaking right, though? It looks flat to me. 1.9 above. We'll come back down to 10. This is 2.4, but it goes down and then back up. I'm going to say 10 because it's 
two degrees down, but then we're going to add two, two foot. We're going to add four foot because it's 0.4 degrees up. 14 degrees. Let's see how we get on. Oh, over hit it. Damn. It's about the right weight though, isn't it? Maybe we're starting to get some consistency here. So again, it's flicking between 0, 09 and 1. It's all downhill, a little bit of uphill. So that's 5 degrees off. And then maybe one foot back on just because it goes back uphill again. So maybe the one foot back on was not necessary. We seem to be getting closer with that. One degree is five foot or thereabouts. So 1.7 is five foot off, which is 15. Um, and then let's say another three foot off that. So I'm going to say 12 feet. Let's try it. Okay. So this one is a straight 10 footer. Maybe slightly less. We'll say 12 foot. Just say 11 foot. Why does it keep breaking to the right? I hate that shot. I always forget that it's going to break to the right. So again, that's just under 10 foot. So we'll say 11. The weight is good. So two foot, uh, two degrees rather, is 10 foot. So we'll take 10 foot off. And then because it's uphill again, we'll probably stay there. Slightly over hit. Nowhere near the hole. Jesus. It is looking more like five foot for every one degree, right? So we're going to take eight foot off this one. Not close enough. Then eight foot off this one. It's the one that goes right. Bloody is. Look how much right that goes. Forgot to take stuff off that, didn't I? Let's restart. Sorry. <clears throat> this is so ridiculous because, you know, in training mode, it's proving how difficult it is. Like, I would be more accurate than this in real life. And I haven't played golf for nearly 10 years. Oh. 
that's within two foot. Terrible. Bloody awful. There's not enough feedback, is there? I think putting needs to be redesigned. Let's just have a little look-see here. So let's keep that on hard. Let's turn the swing meter on. How long's that been on? No, 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 no. Back to simulation mode. Right, so what is this? This is um, downhill by 0.3. Okay, so it's downhill, 0.3. I think we're going to have to take about five feet off that. It's quite a good shot from there, I guess. Again, five foot off. a bit of extra on it by accident put a lot of extra on it by accident I'm gonna say 10 degrees That really breaks hard to the left. I'm seeing, I saw some red squares there. I've never seen those before. 
I think maybe just the colour of the squares is the indication of which way the ground is lying, but I can barely see it. I can barely see it, to be honest with you. Now, this is uphill. Yeah, that went way too far. It's downhill. Five feet off it. Oh, not enough. Just not breaking the back of the putting at all. Stop making challenge. I can do this. In fact, I'm not too bothered about the shots. I'm more worried about the putting. The putting is a real problem for me. Okay, that was far too far. Massive overswing, blow follow through. So. Oh, better, but traveled on a bit, isn't it? Quite a significant under swing that time. A bit too much. Less is more. Wait a minute, I didn't even get one ball onto the green. How is that possible? Chip one ball onto the green. Because it's because it's, it's on pitch. Chip. There we go. Right. So if we go seven eight iron, I said this to you before. It should travel on about the same distance again. So that's half and half again. So eight yards, nineteen yards. This should this should be very close. I did warn you. I like this. This is kind of cool. <laughs> I told you guys, eight iron all the way, baby. <clears throat> and I know it's 16, 8 and 8 is 16, and it's 19 yards away, but you've got a downhill slant over there, don't forget, because we're 0 0.06 degrees above. So I bet you I can do it again, right? Chip shot, 8 iron. I'm not saying necessarily on this shot, but one more time. Ooh. 
It'll be close. Chip shot. Eight iron. There we go. You'll be very happy with that. Chip shot. Eight iron. Come on. Let's get two of these in. I mean that's consistency, right? That's that's clearly coming from a place of actual golfing knowledge. What I mean is the game is realistically replicating what I know to be true. Oh. That should have been a heartbeat moment, shouldn't it? So close. Right, anyway. That's how that's done. Cha-ching. Right, okay, we know how to do all of this. Yeah. Uh, let's... Right, so I've played this hole before, and it's very similar to what I had to do. So we're going to go with the fade. We're going to go with the low fade because we want to keep it down because of the wind. And then we're going to try and hit an absolute beauty. Let's try and get closer to that tree. Oh, that's terrible. That's not what we were trying to do at all, but we got away with it. Try again. Hit it too well. No, we got away with it again. Bloody hell. Maybe the fade is just taking off enough of the wind to stop the wind from being a factor. That could very well be what's happening here, actually. That's interesting. Maybe I want to draw it. Hang on. Let's go fade again. I'm going to try and change the angle of my shot. Yeah, that's definitely coming round to the right. Which is the opposite of what I'm expecting is going to happen. Ah, oh, no! I'm not going to get maximum points now. Let's try a bit of draw. Try a bit of draw and go round the tree, which is what I'm attempting to do. Can't seem to get any fade or draw at all here.
tutorials are quite rubbish. Can we get on the green challenge? Seven foot, slightly uphill. The hole is what, five foot away. Oh, you cheeky gits. Why did that break left? Why did it break left again? There's nothing there that makes me think that's going to break left. Downhill. Oh, it was an effort. Oh, how rude. Not enough power. You have to be really precise on this level of difficulty. Any slight variation makes a big difference to your shot. Agony. Putting is going to be what kicks my ass in this game, I can tell. Right, we're going to go nine foot this time on the marker. Oh, gosh. Oof. Dragged its feet, but in it goes.
So, I mean, it can be done, obviously. Let's try the hardest one. See what happens. Right, what are we looking at? Downhill, 1.5 all downhill. I'm going to take 15 off that, which is 20. I feel like it's breaking to the left. Don't know by how much. Oh, I meant breaking to the right, but it is breaking to the left. That's way, way past, way past. Over hit it. That really is breaking left. Why is, why did I think it was breaking right? Wow, that really is breaking left. 15 is still too much. Oh! It's crazy. How would you re... I mean, how would you look at this green and in any way think that you needed to come back that far and go that wide? There's nothing about this green that makes it look like that is a reality. Oh, that's agonising. This, is this a different hole? That's a different hole, isn't it? It is, it's a different hole. Damn. Hard enough. That could be it. Boom. Oh. 
tricky. Right, so that was a lot of training, a lot of practice. I'm ready, I think, to go and try my career again. Still on hardest possible settings, uh, with one exception. I want to be able to zoom in and then, uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed some of those shots. There's a couple of good ones in there. Till next time, take care. Goodbye for now.